we use an awful lot of wood chips that are recycled here at our studio gardens for mulch. And you see we've put some in front of our garden railway to kind of keep the Bermuda grass from encroaching. And then next year we'll also use this as a planting bed for some perennials. But one thing that's happening this time of year when we get the cooler temperatures and the moisture that I want to bring to your attention, it's actually a pretty common question, is when people start seeing these little mushrooms coming up through the wood chips or the wood mulch. And keep in mind that wood chips are an organic product. There are a lot of carbon, but there's actually fungi or fun fungus or mycelium that's breaking down the wood chips. And so what's happening, the mycelium is growing and breaking down the chips, and the fruiting body is actually the mushroom that you're seeing pop through the ground. So it's not uncommon to see that in wood bark, chips, or mulch. Now the thing that really concerns people though is when they start seeing different types of mushrooms pop up in their lawn. And across Stillwater we're seeing it quite a bit. Uh, and actually just keep in mind that the soil has a little bit of wood in it. It may be tree limbs that have fallen years ago or some pieces of mulch, but there's some kind of wood product in the grass in the soil part and the same thing's happening. It's breaking down and so it's not an uncommon process. Now the more unique ones are called like fairy ring where you actually see a circle of the white mushrooms popping up through the lawn. And because of the thick mycelium that's kind of like thread growing through the soil, sometimes the moisture and the nitrogen don't really get to the right area. And so you'll see even darker green circles and it's pretty obvious. But you'll see these in the spring when we get lots of moisture or during the summer if we get a cool spell and rain and again in the fall. And there's really nothing to worry about. Some people want to come in and spray fungicides. There's no need to do that. The best thing to do is just with your foot, even in the lawn or whatever, just step on them, break them off. No problem at all. It's, it's really not anything that's going to cause disease problems. Just an, another natural process of Mother Nature.